up. Little one. What is going on guys and girls? Welcome back to the Crack Addicts YouTube channel, home to chiropractic media. If you guys haven't already subscribed to the channel, make sure you do if you do enjoy chiropractic content like this. Before we get into the video, if you want to skip the commentary, go straight to one minute and the video will roll out from there. Anyway, getting into today's video, guys and girls, we've got another big chiropractic adjustment compilation. If you want to check out any of the chiropractors, their links will be in the description where you can get in contact with them. If you want to book appointments or go and get treatment done from them, that's how you can do that. If you didn't check out yesterday's video, I'll have a link to that in the description where you can check it out. It got a very good response and I'll throw it up on the screen now so you can see where it is. Make sure you leave a comment in this video. I want to see loads of comments. I want to see your reactions to the video. If you enjoy it, make sure you leave a comment, subscribe, share the video, and I'll let the footage roll now and I'll see you on the next one. Is that okay? Mm -hmm. Up. Little one. This side's probably going to be bigger. Take a breath in and blow it out. Wow, that was nice. <laughs> Feel okay? Mm -hmm. Good. So now slide towards me a little bit. And I'm going to reach under here. Wow, those are good. Perfect. And now lie on your side facing me this way and pull up this top knee. And let me have this uh, hand or the other wrist. Good, and drop your head. And bring your hip down towards me. Nice. And come to the other side. So now I'm at your lumbar, so I'm not at your hip, mm -hmm. okay? I'm way above it. It's, it feels like it's the same general area, but it's not the, it's not the hip. Let's scoot this way. Leg up like this. And I'm going to cut, start low. And then go behind it a little bit. Do you feel that right mm -hmm. there? Does that hurt a lot? Yeah. <laughs> With the IT band, since it's really a structure that's not made to move too much mm -hmm. because of design, it's it's made to stabilize so it doesn't have that. It's, there's not much to foam roll in there. Mm. But, uh, <laughs> But here I'm below and above, do you see? Yeah, and my hips are really yeah, good on so, the too. But he gives you some really good good ideas on how to stretch it and how to work with it. IT band hell. <laughs> good, okay. So I'm not gonna adjust that hip because that hip is vulnerable. Mm -hmm. And we just met and I'm not gonna be that person for <laughs> you today. start off, I always go right through this upper thoracic area. I'm gonna start off with the adjustment right through here. You probably felt that quite a bit. <laughs> I know, it's a lot of years of never being adjusted. Whew. There we go, got a lot of movement in there. We're gonna go through the thoracic spine. Just gonna help open things up, because I know that, that previously that you were a hairdresser, a lot of times, well, obviously, you know, your hands are up, you're always, you know, your shoulders are up, your arms are up, you usually create a lot of tension right through this upper back area. So what I'm gonna have you do now, take a deep breath in, and exhale all the way out. Just a little bit there. We're gonna do the same thing one more time, deep breath in, and exhale out. Good. So I'm gonna have you bend that top knee for me. Good. You good, you good. I'm gonna bring you up just like that. And just lay and relax. Yep. You felt that all right through there, right? <laughs> lay flat on your back for me. So we're gonna do that leg pull. We're gonna be tractioning out between the knee, the hip, and also in that lumbar spine, that pelvic and lumbar spine. So I know she's feeling that a lot, that femur head getting pulled, correct? You know what I'm saying? Okay. So I'm gonna... Yep. Oh my God. 
lay um, on your stomach for me. I want to recheck your leg line. We got a lot of movement in there, so. Marcy, so. Yep. Just lay flat. Bring your legs towards the head of the table here. So what we're gonna do, I just wanna go through. We're gonna move the cervical spine. And feel how the neck is moving. We're getting, we're getting good movement. Got a little bit of tightness, so. so just relax. Okay. Same thing over here, just relax. Good. All right, one at a time, one here. One like that, and this is the one, take a deep breath in. As I bring you down, I want you to exhale all the way out, okay? So deep breath in, and exhale out. <laughs> you notice that quite a bit. You feel how everything just opened up with that one adjustment. That's gonna distract them in that, you're good there. And basically, the whole point of the y-axis distraction, we're just gonna be taking pressure off of those nerves in between the vertebrae, okay? <laughs> So we traction her out. It's a very just simple adjustment. <laughs> there you go. How was that? That's not nice, actually. Good adjustment, so. There you go. Yes, sir, boy. Crack Ace gonna love you. Yep. Okay. You feel all those? Yes, sir. Not paralyzed yet, are you? No. Okay. <laughs> okay, let's turn you on your back. Yeah, that's so ridiculous. No, put your hands on your tummy. There you go. Let me have this leg. Let it go like a limp rag. There you go. Now you should have felt that from your knee all the way up to your lower back. Yes, sir. Okay. Same thing here. Let me have this leg. Yeah, there you go. Super. Okay, let's sit Jeff face out of the way. Sideways. There you go. There you go. No way I could paralyze you if I threw you out this 11 to 10 story window and land on your head in the parking lot. <laughs> he hasn't had any bladder bowel dysfunction, which is a major neurological sequel event that we look for and always ask severe lumbar hernia disc patients. Now I want you just to breathe through your nose. Keep your teeth together. Yes, sir. Oh. Home runs. <laughs> See, we know he's not paralyzed. I saw his legs wiggling already, <laughs> didn't you? Yes, sir. And look at there, he's still kicking. <laughs> Yeah, Batman's noisy this afternoon. <laughs> and so, um, yeah, so it's interesting. Yeah. Cause and effect, cause and effect. That's true. Yep, so just relax. Got a simple adjustment today. Good. Good. Remember that? <laughs> yeah, that was a lot. <laughs> That's a lot, right? That's a lot. Okay, one more time this side. It's not painful. Good. Good, nice. Oh, that was painful. That was painful a little bit? So, um, so. Oh, yeah, um, seriously, yeah. Yeah, it's so funny. Okay, so let's get this. So his wife's on camera today and she's doing all these artistic shots. <laughs> so if you guys like this the shots here, don't expect our my wife to do it. <laughs> oh it's sore. It's sore right here? Yeah. Up here or down here? Right there. Not middle. Middle, yeah, right yeah. there. Yeah. Good. 
Okay, turn to the left of it. Beautiful. Good, nice. You know, I don't have anything against specific chiropractors. In fact, I like them because we see a lot of their patients. To each his own. Those techniques do work in some cases on certain conditions. Uh, I've just adapted this Johnson chiropractic technique from 37 years of experience. And now, Christian, palms up. Come on, adjust your shoulders. Now, Christian fractured his clavicle back in. 2002, you said, or 2004. Left clavicle, so I adjusted his sternal clavicular joints and his anterior ribs there. Okay, I want you to relax your hands on your tummy. Let me have your leg here. Just let it go limp. There you go. There. That's it. Okay, slide back up that way a little bit. I'm going to take your shoes off, if that's okay. Yep. There we go. You feel that in your left ankle? Mm -hmm. Yep. There we go. Good. Okay, let's set you up face that way for me, please, sir. Now, he's had problems specifically with his left shoulder, but both shoulders have given him troubles. So I just a little humeral joint on his right one first, and his left one's worse. Does that cause pain when I get this high? Not right now, but... Okay, but usually? Mm hmm Okay, let this go. Just let it go limp. There you go. We'll check it afterwards. Lay your head back. Now breathe through your nose. Keep your teeth together and just relax. Mm -hmm. There you go. Yes, sir. Felt that all the way down, didn't you? Mm -hmm. Yep. You got a little bit more on that one and a lot more on that one. Okay, this is a Palmer Diversified Rotary Brake. Oh yeah. It's like a bowl of Rice Krispies. I'm just pouring on the milk. Alrighty. So guys like you that get my workout in every day. Isaac. Legs, that felt easier that time, didn't oh, it? Oh, yes. Yes, sir. Okay, let's turn you on your back now, please, sir. Now, I've never seen any other chiropractors adjust that. Have you? No. <laughs> and you can't get out of here without me pulling your leg. <laughs> Super. Okay, let's hit you up and face that away for a second. <laughs> there we go. See, you always know when I get a good adjustment when I'm tap on your spine, too. Oh, yeah. I've on my head several times, though. That's what your wife told me. <laughs> Okay, nice. Here, put your hands right here. Breathe through your nose. Keep your teeth together. And exhale. No oh, shit! <laughs> Fuck! Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> you should have felt oh, that all the way God. down. Yes, I did. And I can do it again for you. Oh, no, I felt good. <laughs> okay, let this go. There you go. Oh, That's it. damn. <laughs>